Okay, we have our kind of um, cracks, we have our erosions. Let's go to combine them together. Because for this one, we'll go to use the combiner. And we'll take it one from our, no, it's permanent right here. Uh, sometimes I have a hard time to connecting. There you go. Next one, we'll take from here and connect it. So in combiner, we go to set to the minimum on that. And we'll go pop up all the way to the max this way. Okay, the couple of things does not necessarily look because if we check right now, you can see we have it, but it's cracks on all land. I don't necessarily want the cracks on the land. I just want more close to the edge around this area. So for that one, we'll need it also um, a set mask for our combiner. And I think from here, from this purlin, we can take it and add mask. Okay, so it does, um, let me actually switch these nodes. So we'll have it primary, that is problem was primary, secondary. Okay, so we'll go preview. And you can see we have it very nice crack schooling. Again, because we did with a blur, so they're kind of applying, but they're nicely going around. And if we have this lava path going through, so it will look more interesting this way. Okay, except it's covered some areas, so I'll just go bring this almost all the way to the edge. This way we'll kind of remove it. Okay, there you go. So, okay, it's look kind of interesting, this on the edge, it was going after this. We have some lava path with a crackling. And it's a similar idea what we did with the labyrinth type. Let's go back now. And let's add a little bit more details to this. So one I want to do, it's a go take terrace. We'll all open this. It just add sideways kind of looking for them. So we'll go connect terrace right here. Um, we'll go with the sharp. You know, maybe pop up this just a little bit up, a little bit more here. And we'll just, let's go to a um, couple layerings. The one thing um, about terrace, I don't necessarily like when they're straight kind of going around so what I'm going to do from this perlin i'm just going and controlling mod modulations as well so it's meaning on the edges will kind of going with modulations as well and we'll just go and take from this area where we equalize and we'll add to the masking so i want to have on side so i don't want it in other areas of the um okay let's go back right there so I don't want this going on other, I just want on the edges, but not here. So that's what I mask. And you can see right there with modulations, the kind of going interesting on the sides, almost like eat into the rocks. Okay, next to kind of blend everything together, let's add one more of the erosion. And overall, erosions help us in sometimes kind of blend them together a little bit better. So we have a channel. We don't necessarily want to have it too high, just a little bit on this, you know, some small touch. Uh, but you can always play a little bit more around with this and see um, how they look for you. Okay, so just a little bit erosion to connect. But let's do this way. Let's go click, lock this. So we'll keep it same lock on this. And in this case, I can open erosion inside. And you can see we can bring a little bit more. But notice right here, we start kind of clumping on the bottom as a segment. So we want lower segment right there. And bring a little bit more without. We can refresh. And there you go. We have a nice path with cracking. So erosion added to this effect right around. I think it's look interesting and the kind of almost ground, you know, eroded in some other areas. Okay, okay, let's go back. Right there, we, again, I want to preview. So we have 
unlock this one. So we have it going path. Plumbing right there. Okay, I think that now we can start adding some notes. So I'm going to output. And we'll go create as usual output to first. So let's go copy paste. We'll create our standard outputs right here. We'll go to connect to those. Uh, beside these outputs, I also would interest to have output from just path. So if I want to take top, bottom one and add maybe red lava as a texture, so I want to extract this. And um, we can go with the selectivity. So we connect it. We'll just go connect right here. You can see we have the path. Let's also take and add to the mask. Okay, right there. So we isolating a little bit better on this case. We also can go inside the string. Let's see what we have it. And we can pop up string a little bit higher. So you notice we have it now very nice path that we can use it as well. Okay, now we can go add to this point. And also I want maybe add um, some effect to rocks so between them as well will be have kind of going lava so we'll add one more node and same things we'll go add connectivity to this let's do connect our output from our combiner we'll go connect to connectivity so it's very nice except the masking i need to kind of adjust so i'll go from equalization here which we're using for other masks so right there you can see because it's an area where we about will have those um, kind of rocks going. Same things so we can go and pop up string a little bit higher. And let's connect it then. And here so we have our um, kind of ground land where the lava can go in the middle and we have this crackling land going around and we also have it maps for all of this so we can add red between them with materials and some lava on the back and we'll probably do this inside the view try to retouch so this will be next portions of the tutorials